glowing skin in winters. If that's what you are looking for, then this is the video for you. The skin on our face is much thinner than on the other parts of the body and accordingly needs more care. Especially in winters, it gets really tricky to maintain the glow on our face. But don't worry, as in this video, I'll share with you a secret to get glowing skin overnight. So stay tuned. Hello friends, welcome to FitTuber. Winters has its own charm, but certainly it's a hard time for the skin. The cold weather and low humidity takes away the moisture from the skin. This leads to dry, dull and wrinkly skin. And there is no doubt about the fact that due to excessive pollution, sun exposure and extreme weather conditions, our skin tends to lose its natural tone and becomes dark and dull. And if you are one of those who try to seek refuge under the umbrella of so-called fairness creams, then you are just wasting your time and money. So in this video, I am going to share with you one highly effective home remedy which will remove the clogged dirt and impurities of your skin, nourish it with essential nutrients and in just one application, you will see a significant difference in your skin tone and glow. Basically, it is a homemade night cream which involves just three simple ingredients. To make it, take one teaspoon of glycerin. Glycerin alone has some amazing benefits for healthier looking skin. It acts like a natural toner, moisturizer and is a perfect cleanser. Glycerin is also known for skin lightening, restoring your natural skin tone. You can easily get it from a chemist shop. The next ingredient that you will need is 1 teaspoon of pure gulab jal. Rose water has been used in Ayurvedic skin remedies for thousands of years. Rich in antioxidants, it is known to soften the skin and increase the skin glow naturally. Being anti-inflammatory, it curbs the acne from its very source. I have already discussed in one of my previous videos as to why Patanjali Gulab Jal is pure while Dabar Gulabari has many harsh chemicals in it. The final ingredient to be used is again 1 teaspoon of lemon juice. Lemon juice is known to be anti-aging. Being a good source of vitamin C, lemon juice repairs the damaged skin cells as well as helps you get rid of fine lines, blemishes, wrinkles, etc. So as you can see, all the three ingredients were taken in the same ratio. Mix them properly. Now at night, before going to sleep, after you have washed your face, take this mixture and using a cotton ball, apply it gently and evenly on your face. That's all, you can now go to sleep while this powerful concoction will keep doing its work. And the next morning, the result that you will see will just amaze you. You will find a significant change in your skin tone and glow. This is because the powerful mixture of these ingredients have removed the unseen dirt and impurities leaving behind younger looking softer and clearer skin. Even though the ingredients used are very easily available near you, but still for your convenience, I have linked them in the description box of this video. You can do this every night, especially in this season as the cool winds take away the natural glow of your skin, leaving it dry. You can even take all the three ingredients and keep it stored in a bottle for a week. I can bet on the effectiveness of this remedy. I've seen my mother doing the same exact thing every winter for so long and the results have been just amazing. This season, do try it and the problem of dry, dull, wrinkly skin can will be history for you so friends that's all for this video i hope you found it to be helpful if yes and if you would like to see a similar video on how to make anti hairfall mask at home then please let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up it is another highly effective ayurvedic remedy and if you have any doubts regarding this glowing skin remedy then please feel free to comment below please do remember to subscribe to my channel hit that bell icon so that you never miss a video from me my name is Vivek. I thank you so much for watching.